Welcome back everyone, Broben here. Today we're back in the forest on day 222 of our survival, all the twos. So today, as you've seen by the title and thumbnail, we're going to be building the new church. Now, I mentioned last episode, I think, that I wanted to build like a creepy church in the woods that I'd stumble across every now and again. I think that's a really cool concept. Um, so that's exactly what we're going to be doing. Now, last episode, I got all of the new unlockables. So if I go to my blueprints here, I can now build the church, the cross, the coffin, I can build the glider, the tower, and the log track. Wait, did they rename that just now? I think an update came out that renamed it from... from Coaster. Yeah, it was Coaster, I swear. Anyway, so we're gonna go to the main island here, we're gonna go somewhere deep in the woods, and we're just gonna throw up this church. Because it just requires so many logs, I think it's a really good idea to make it... hold on a second. I just realized I've got to turn my ocean quality back up because it looks disgusting. There we go. Okay, so we're going to go deeper. I, th I think, like, down south here is very, very good. Um, I'm actually going to go just south of the sinkhole and check that location out. I think that's probably a good place to start. Okay, so this location looks pretty good. It's just now a case of finding some flat terrain. And I think I just came across it. Yeah. Oh, this looks so good. Imagine a church here. Oh, God. This would be so good. All right, I'm going to chop down a few trees. You know what? Let's have a little bit of fun here. Very rarely do I get to have a bit of fun with dynamite and explosives in this game. So let's do it. <laughs> oh, my God. I just got four trees, five trees, six trees. Oh my God. And again? <laughs> what was that? One, two, three. Four, five. Jeez, I think they've increased the range. I think maybe actually, no, 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 no. I think this is just a really dense forest area, so let's just roll with that. So now I'm going to go around clearing all these stumps because it's quite a big building. So I'm going to clear all these out so the trees don't regrow and sort of mess up our build. Now I'm actually thinking, <gasps> dude, I can make a graveyard too. Oh, I said so should do that. That's great. So we've got coffins that I can place down in like an organized checkerboard fashion. And then I can use the bone fence to go around. This thing's going to look so creepy. Now I'm going to face it this way purely because I want the staircase in to be like super smooth. Like that. Yeah. And that should be straight up and in. I think anyway. It's only five sticks. Wow. 95 logs. Let's do this. Now... Just having a quick discussion about the pyramid, uh, I've been thinking about what I can do with the interior. Now, actually, I think I'm really happy that I waited until the update came out. Oh, this is looking cool. Um, to start working on the interior, because I want to make a tomb. Now, I think I mentioned a crypt last time I was talking about it, but now that I've seen the coffins, you know where I'm going with this? Yeah, we're going to make, well, I think what they're called, sarcophagus. I'm going to make a few of those, a cough guy, and we're going to just make the whole place into a tomb, a burial chamber. It's going to look so damn cool. I'm going to be working on that soon, maybe a few episodes in the future. I think I'm just going to spend a little bit of time on checking out the new stuff, because, you know, how often do you get to see brand new stuff in the forest, you know? So, now I just noticed that I've got to be careful not to destroy too many trees around this, because I want to maintain that sort of, like, creepy look, and I think I've nailed it here. So I'm trying to think where the graveyard can go. Um, probably around the side here next to all the rocks. Yeah. Wow, got so many logs already. That's so good. Now, I haven't come across the new mutant yet. Uh, people are saying there's two new mutants, three new mutants, but I've only ever seen one, uh, which is like the worm-looking one. And I hope I encounter that soon. Um, I'm on like, what, day 222 now, so I really start, I really think like if it's a late game creature, it should be spawning for me, so, god, I don't want to see it now, not what I'm building. <laughs> okay, how many logs are we on? Halfway. Oh, the cannibals here. Oh, that scared me. Are they saying hi or just watching? Looks to me like they're just watching. <gasps> Armor. Hold it. Really? You're not going to leave after me taking out one of your cannibals? What about two? <laughs> Dude, aimbot, I'm telling you. <laughs> Whoa, okay. 
So last night I've been working on the structure. It's all down to one log remaining now, as you can see right here, 94, 95. And on the left, I worked on the graveyard. Very, very small, but it's sort of relative to the church. You know, it's a very small church. Hello, bird. And I think it suits it very, very well. I know they're coffins. They should be like, you know, it makes no sense for them to be above ground, like just laying there. They should be buried. I know, but it looks, it looks, it fits the part. Once I got the fence in, I think this is going to look very, very nice. So. Let's grab this and finish the build here. <laughs> That's cool. How do I get on top? There's got to be a way. Definitely. So let's go inside. I wonder if I can use the chairs. I haven't seen... You can set a home here? <gasps> oh, no, it's a log. Oh, damn it. Wait, can you not... I don't think you can sit on these benches, you know? Let's try it. Nope. Doesn't look like it at all. <laughs> Okay, end night game, seriously. Make it so you can sit down. That's just, oh god, atrocious. Now, I don't have anything to place in here at the moment. This is just for like, wow, god, the roof is disgusting. Wow. They need to do something about roofs. Like, you can see through them, is what I'm pointing at. Like, that shouldn't be a thing. You know? Like, you should be able to insulate it with leaves. That'd be a cool idea. So, look, <laughs> I just came up to this because I went back to the base overnight and I was coming up to it and. Damn, was it creepy just to find this in the woods? Like, it's gonna be so good. You know what? I'm gonna start working on this. How many logs is it for... Okay, 11. Wow! No way! 11 logs for the coffins. That's incredible. That should've been one log right there. This is way too expensive. So I've gotten everything down in the graveyard to the last piece of the blueprint, and I'm gonna go ahead and just, you know, finish everything here pretty much. Damn pebble. There we go. Nice. Just got the coffins to go. I'm actually really surprised how expensive those coffins are. That really shocked me. 11 logs for that? Damn. You know, a lot of structures, thinking about it, that have made you know, things like this, you know, like the storage units, they're all pretty expensive. Definitely a common trend. Although, I've got to say, they do have more detail, though. So... You know, I, I guess you can't really complain. And there's the last log. Nice. I like how it clears the plants around when you build it. That's really nice. So the graveyard's done. The church is done. I think on the inside I'm going to place a few lights down. Where can I put those? Hmm. I think just in the corners, pretty much. No, wait. You can't attach lights in here? Okay, of course you can put them underneath the foundations. Oh, wow. That sucks. That actually sucks. Okay, well, I guess we'll have to roll with these, which actually look quite nice in the corners. There we go. Nice. Just what? Oh, I can build it in here. <gasps> it fits perfectly. Okay, it's going to block off the window. Uh, You know what? I think I'm going to build it in here. Let me see. If I place it there. <laughs> do I do it? I don't know. Yeah, I, I'm actually going to vote against that. Um, I think it looks quite nice as it is. You know, with the graveyard, with the church, nothing overkill. That cross is definitely for, like, I don't know, on top of a hill or something like that. That would look really nice. So as for this build, it is now completely done. I'm going to wait until the trees regrow, and then this is going to look so damn cool. Just got to do a little bit of tidying up here. There we go. So I really want to start working towards fighting the new enemy that's in the game. I'm 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 prepared, but I just can't find it. Um, I I've completed the game. I've done the alternate ending. So fingers crossed, that is all of the requirements. I think there's nothing else I can really do in terms of requirements for like enemy spawns. And I know it does spawn above ground. So I think I'm probably going to end up fighting that enemy in the next episode. In today's episode, I just unfortunately don't have enough time. I've been spending way too much time on this build. But it's very nice. It's actually quite quick, to be honest. It turned out very well. I'm really happy with the graveyard. It looks super cool. I could even add a few lights out here, to be honest. Yeah. Alright everyone, well unfortunately I've run out of time for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it, it was just a nice quick build, like I mentioned, I just wanted to make a creepy little church in the middle of the woods that I'd stumble across every now and again, it might startle me, you never know. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, if you did, please be sure to press the like button. If you're not already, make sure to get subscribed to the channel, I'm posting a lot more videos on this update, so make sure to get subscribed. Thank you so much for watching everyone, and I will catch you 
in the next video.